you guys ready? Okay, so now we're going to look at the scapula. Uh, in order to figure out left versus right for the scapula, you want to find the spine of the scapula. Uh, the spine of the scapula needs to be posterior, and the subscapular fossa needs to be anterior. And then you want to find glenoid cavity, which is right here, glenoid cavity. And you want to make sure that glenoid cavity is facing laterally. So that when you put this on, the spine is posterior, glenoid cavity is lateral, so therefore this is the left scapula. As far as parts are concerned, we have the borders. So this is the lateral border, this is the medial border, see that? And then this is the superior border up here. We have our angles, inferior angle, superior angle, and lateral angle. We have the coracoid process, we have the acromion process, we have the spine of the scapula, we have the supraspinous fossa, infraspinous fossa, glenoid cavity, where the head of the humerus will go, and the subscapular fossa.